Welcome to Big Joe and Malia's world. What are we cooking today, honey? We're cooking easy, cheesy chicken. Cheddar cheese, chicken, cream of chicken soup, and milk. All right, guys. First step in easy cheesy chicken is you want to heat the cream of chicken soup and the milk over medium heat. Just until it simmers. So we're going to put that on first so that it can be simmering while we assemble the rest. Okay, now that we get that in there, give it a little stir. We're gonna go ahead and assemble the rest. All right, <clears throat> with the chicken, first thing you wanna do is take boneless, skinless chicken and cook it. Boil it, you can, I used chicken broth to boil mine and a little bit of salt and pepper. And you want to cook it until it's done and then you wanna take it out and let it cool and shred it. So, in a bowl, we're going to take the chicken, take the cooked shredded chicken, put it in a bowl, and we're going to add half of the cheddar cheese. And we're just going to kind of toss it together. It doesn't have to be perfect. All right, now for the assembly. You're just going, going to open your um, crescent rolls and take them apart along the preparation. There should be eight of them. And it's always better to leave these in the refrigerator until you're ready to assemble because it makes it easier to take them apart. So we're just going to take them apart, <clears throat> lay them on a plate, and we'll start the assembly. All right. You need to preheat your oven to 375 degrees and spray with cooking spray a 9 by 13 pan. So, you're going to take just a little bit with each roll. You're going to take a little bit of the cheese chicken mixture and just roll them up just like that and place them in the pan. And you just want to repeat this till it's complete. And give them plenty of space between the um, the rolls so they'll cook pretty good. Once you get all your chicken rolled up in your crescent rolls, all your chicken and cheese rolled up in your crescent rolls, it's going to look like this. Doesn't have to be pretty, doesn't have to be perfect, just roll them up. <clears throat> and if you've got any of the chicken cheese mixture left, just put it in the bottom of the pan or just sprinkle it on top. Just like that. Okay. Now we're going to put this in a 375 degree preheated oven for about 10 minutes. Okay, once you've had it in the oven for about 10 minutes, go ahead and take it out of the oven, and it's not quite done yet, but you want to cook it for a few minutes to get the tops of the croissants a little bit crusty so you can pour the hot soup on. So, take your soup and milk mixture, give it a stir with a whisk to make sure there's not any lumps in it, and you want to just pour it over the top. All right, once you get that poured in, you want to take the rest of the cheese and shake it over the top. 
All right. Now you're going to return this to the oven for about five or six minutes. Okay, here's what the easy cheesy chicken looks like when you get it out of the oven. So let's let it cool for just a minute and we'll let Big Joe do the taste test. Okay guys, the moment of truth. Let's see how Big Joe likes the easy cheesy chicken. It's really good, guys. Really good. Really cheesy. And you can taste that cream of chicken soup. It's really good. Let's get another bite. Mm-hmm. I honestly could eat this for breakfast, lunch, or supper. It's amazing. You know what I say? Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm. Well, that's it for the easy cheesy chicken. If you try this recipe, please let us know in the comments. We'd love to know how you like it. And we're getting to all your recipes, guys. So make sure you keep those recipes coming. We'd love to try all your recipes, guys. And as always, thank you for allowing a little bit of Big Joe and Malia's world into your world. Thanks, guys. See you soon. Bye. Bye.